And welcome back. This is Inside on Business, the news hour. My name is Michael Libby, and we're live on Webcast One Live, powered by our advertising agency, Inside Advertising, Marketing, and Communications. This is all being brought to us by our friends at Fuerza, F U I R. S-A-dot-com, F-U-I-R-S-A-dot-com. These are trained accountants in tax and business that will work hard for you until the cows come home. Why do we say good things about them? Because they've been our accounting firm quite some time, and we're very pleased. Fuerza, F-U-I-R-S-A. You can find them in Clive, Iowa. I have a green card, so I can go back and forth from Urbandale to Clive and, uh, and get those kinds of things done. Fuerza, F-U-I-R-S-A. In the studio is this gentleman. This is Dan Halstead, and we're talking about his company. Um, so tell me, when we had a conversation, and I hope this isn't going to be a sensitive issue, right? I think this no, is. You're okay. of 
invading brick and mortar right. structure to do, but they're being very successful because they have figured it out. They don't need to take on that massive loan and to get started. And that could be that could be a benefit, and that could be a crime. Absolutely. I mean, when you don't have that overhead, some there's mornings that you know it depends on the personality, but sometimes you're not getting pushed, you're not scared enough, really, to get out there and do the things that you're supposed to do. We're scared every day. <laughs> I think I think you should be anybody that's smart enough to be scared is is yeah. going to be more successful. Yeah, yeah, I would agree. Dan Holstead, ladies and gentlemen, it is uh, evolving edge graphics, and they do all kinds of work in the space of. Um, of design. We, we talked about car wraps. Uh, billboard? You don't do billboards. Do no, we don't do billboards. Right. Uh, there are other large format digital right. printing companies that specialize in that. I, I believe very, very strongly in do what you do well. Absolutely. And, and not get, I partner up with quite a few other businesses that have their niche, and we have ours, um, because the, the quality of that product that you're putting out essentially is what people are going to remember you by. I, I loved your comment, by the way, Dan, about utilizing advertising agencies and marketing absolutely. firms, you know, because you're absolutely right. Um, it, this is a commercial, ladies and gentlemen, but, but, <laughs> but exactly. I mean, that's what we do. We don't make anything. We, we don't make pens or pencils or, or wires or cords or anything like that, cameras, we make what will instill a want in consumers. Right. And, and it, sometimes it's really hard to get a small business
layout for eight years. I mean, people just blew right on by it after it, it, year it's one. Still, you start yeah. to not see it yeah, anymore. It's just, and, and so in your business, that's something that you're trying to do. It's uh, changing and, all the yeah. time. You know, any uh, anything that we produce, uh, you know, every business makes trinkets. Our trinkets that we make uh, with the intent that they're going to change their message. They're either going to change their product, it's going to be evolving with their industry. Uh, they're going to want something fresh. They, 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 you know, people get uh, kind of complacent to that message that they've seen, like you said, for eight years with that right. particular one. Yeah, it just doesn't, doesn't, doesn't work. Thanks so very much for coming in and hanging Thank around for here for me. just a minute. That is our, our pleasure. Thanks for um coming into the rescue, so to speak. Oh, uh, next week, ladies and gentlemen, in the chair, we're going to have Bo Fodor. Bo Fodor is with Panache. You know Bo? I, uh, I'm familiar with Bo. Yeah, yes. Bo, Bo's an amazing guy. <laughs> uh, you talk about a I, I, I bet he doesn't wear khakis. I bet he doesn't wear khakis. Yeah, I, I don't know. Uh, Dan Hall said, ladies and gentlemen, from Evolving Edge Graphics in the house today, talking about his business, his brand new business, by the way. If you're in the uh, market uh, looking for somebody that's aggressive and in the sign business, you might want to visit with Dan. Um, let's take a look at what we think is the very best campaign that we saw last week. You know, sometimes, sometimes kids saying you're sorry really does mean something. And uh, here's an example uh, of that very thing. You know, when, when you say you're sorry and you, you admit that you're wrong and you take it very public, you know, it could have a very positive impact on your customers. Let's take a look at this piece. It's no secret. Recently, J.C. Penny changed. Some changes you liked, and some you didn't. But what matters with mistakes is what we learn. We learned a very simple thing. To listen to you. To hear what you need to make your life more beautiful. Come back to JC Penny. We heard you. Now we'd love to see you. And the tagline is JC Penny. Back and see us following the ouster of Ron Johnson, a tumultuous 17 months as the CEO of JCPenney, and they went through all kinds.
means of confusing things. They had no sales, and then they were going to go limited sales, and then they uh, they changed their graphics, which we thought was absolutely dynamite, and and some of their mailings they went minimalist on uh, some of their looks. We thought it was very effective and, and did very well, but they were confusing their core customer, and their core customer left them in droves. I don't know if you recall, but not very long ago, we talked about J.C. Penny. They spent more money in 2012 on advertising, but yet uh, saw a 25% decrease in revenues. Uh, that's pretty tough to take, and the writing was on the wall. And that's one of those instances, kids, that you might want to take a look at your business, and if you've done something to tick off your consumers, you might want to go ahead and say, hey, I'm sorry. J.C. Penny, and come back and see us. We know we goofed. Perhaps the best campaign of last week. Thanks very much for being with us. This has been Insight on Business, the News Hour. My name is Michael Libby. We're here each and every Monday live at 8.45 on webcast one live or back on our blog and on the internet and on YouTube whenever you want. All right. Thanks very much for being with us. Our thanks once again to Dan Halstead for coming in and sharing his knowledge about the graphics industry and signage. Uh, our thanks for uh, on behalf of our producer, Ryan Northfield, and the rest of the crew from Inside Advertising, Marketing, and Communications. This has all been brought to us by our friends at FUIRSA, F-U-I-R-S-A, tax accountants and business analysts that know what they're doing. They'll work hard for you until the cows come home. Take care of yourself. Be safe. Be well. Be careful. Most of all, 